Welcome, uh, welcome back to uh, Ceja Vineyards. As you can see, uh, uh, someone said if a bachi cord is fun, well, we are going to double the fun. We are currently uh, making a second uh, bachi cord. A lot of individuals have the, uh, the idea uh, that the Italians uh, invented bachi. And you will find that actually this game of bachi its origins they go back probably some five thousand years based on the science of uh, archaeologists uh, when they have uh, discovered new tombs in uh, egypt they have found that in the walls of the tombs uh, there are a number of individuals of characters uh, they're standing up and they have some kind of a ball of, of sorts was that bachi? Well, I'm sure that was not bachi, but that is the what is believed to be the uh, the beginning, the cradle of modern bachi. The major contribution of the Italians is that right after World War I, right around 1917, 1918, they organized the first world tournament of bachi, and so they were very instrumental in setting up. Uh, rules, dimensions, so on and so forth. And so, yes, thanks to the uh, Italians, thanks to the, um, well, the Egyptians, the, the Greeks, so on and so forth, the old world, we have this modern game of bachi. And so, Seja is contributing in promoting the, uh, the fun with a glass of wine and also throwing the ball. The construction of a modern bachi cord is no different than if you are creating a foundation for a pad or for a house for that matter. As you can see we have the, the forms. Uh, then once we pour the, uh, the cement, we're going to be uh, creating a bed of three, uh, approximately three to four inches of heavy rock. Uh, and this is all for drainage. So on top, on top of the bed of heavy rock, we're going to lay three drainage pipes uh, on the sides and one in the center. That way, in the winter, the water will not accumulate and we will end up with a swimming pool instead of a uh, bachi cord. Uh, so once we lay the, the pipe, we're going to lay another couple of inches of heavy rock. Then on top of that, we're going to create a layer of three quarter of an inch uh, river rock, if you will, or crush rock. Then on top, we're going to uh, create a, another inch or so of sand. And then at the very top, we're going to terminate it with approximately three to four inches of crushed granite. Thank you for uh, joining me in showing you some details as to how to make a bachi cord. I can assure you that making a bachi cord is almost as fun as playing a, a, a game of bachi. Whenever you find yourself in Napa, please come and visit us. I would love to share a glass of wine with you and also show you how to play a game of bachi. Let the good times roll. Salud!